so hello students uh, today we see some more problems based on hardness of water okay let's see the first one one liter of a sample of hard water contains 5.55 milligrams of calcium chloride and 4.75 milligrams of magnesium chloride so the total hardness in terms of ppm of caco3 is so you could have so which type of hardness is present in this water so sometimes in questions uh, so it is also asked that uh, which type of hardness is present here we know the chlorides and sulfates of calcium and magnesium are responsible for permanent hardness so it is manaki chlorides so chlorides ka but ikkada ochina hardness permanent hardness okay next uh, in the question it is given find the hardness in terms of ppm of caco3 ante a hardness ki responsible ane a salt aina ante bicarbonate sulfates chlorides we done it manam deniki equalize chestam ante we equalize with the calcium carbonate okay because that is the standard value okay so now see uh, first step actually ikkada calcium chloride tho hardness vastadi uh, magnesium chloride tho hardness vastadi సో రెండింటి హార్డ్నెస్ మనం సో యాడ్ చేయాల్సి ఉంటుంది ఓకే బికాస్ ఇట్ ఈ టోటల్ ఆఫ్ వన్ శాంపిల్ ఓకే దట్స్ వై ఇట్ ఈస్ ఆల్సో ఇట్ ఈస్ గివెన్ దట్ టోటల్ హార్డ్నెస్ మెయిన్ హార్డ్నెస్ డ్యూ టు ద కాల్షియం క్లోరైడ్ అండ్ హార్డ్నెస్ డ్యూ టు ద మెగ్నీషియం క్లోరైడ్ వి హ్యావ్ టు ఫైండ్ బోత్ అండ్ యాడ్ ఇట్ సో ఈ కాల్షియం క్లోరైడ్ వి హ్యావ్ టు ఈక్వలైజ్ ద కాల్షియం కార్బోనేట్ కంపేరింగ్ ద మాలిక్యులర్ వైస్ 111 గ్రామ్స్ ఆఫ్ కాల్షియం కార్బోనేట్ సారీ కాల్షియం క్లోరైడ్ is equal to 100 grams of both are molecular weights this kuna manam so this is manam milligrams lo convert it down 5.55 into 10 to minus 3 grams so milligrams lo on the we have to convert it to grams okay so how much calcium carbonate so we got 5 into 10 to minus 3 grams of CaCO3 okay we need to 1 liter lo 5 into 10 to minus 3 grams of CaCO3 on the okay for the 1 liter lo how much mgcl t is present find out it okay in terms of caco3 so magnesium chloride and calcium carbonate so compare their molecular weights so what is the magnesium chloride is the 24, 71, so on this uh, calculation we will get uh, again 5 okay define so exactly we will get uh, say 5 into 10 to minus 3 grams of uh, calcium carbonate so it is also present in one lit same one liter sample of water this also present in the same one liter sample okay so now we have to find out the total hardness total hardness so therefore the amount of uh, total CaCO3 in one liter of uh, total calcium carbonate in 1 liter hard water equal to so just now we did so calcium chloride converted to the calcium carbonate grams so plus again it is also we got both values same so finally we get 
So 10 power minus 3 comma this is 5 plus 5 we get 10. 10, 10 into 10 power minus 3. So that is equal to 0 0.01 gram. Okay, means uh, what is the total? What is the total amount of calcium carbonate is uh, 0 0.01 gram in how many liters? 1 liters. Okay. See, so, one important thing in the day. So, one milligrams cloth check just 10 power 6 milligrams compared yeah. 10, 10 power 10 power 6 milligrams of water ki compared yeah. Same because grams cloth is put 10 power 6 grams ki compared yeah. Okay. So, my molecular weight is covered in grams cloth is put That's why we converted it into grams. So, we direct the milligram to problem just there. So, 10 power 6 milligrams ki find out child finally. Okay. Therefore, hardness uh, 0 0.01 gram. So, 0 0.01 gram is in how much? It's a 1 liter. So, see per liter. So, per liter means here see 1 liter hard water. Contain 0 0.01 gram calcium carbonate so one liter means uh, how many milliliters milliliters grams okay this part okay milliliters means 10 power 3 milliliters milliliters means it is nothing but equal to 10 power 3 grams of water so because uh, what is the density of water density of water is 1 gram per milliliter 1 gram per milliliter that milliliter madam that the gram of this coach water kit so hard water contains uh, 0 0.01 gram of CaCO3 then what about uh, 10 power 6 gram of water is how much so just on cancellation so 3 3 remaining 3 10 power 3 is 10 power minus 2 so finally we will get uh, okay, 10 grams okay so we will get 10 grams so therefore that is equal to 10 ppm so we will get 10 power 6 grams of water loan na calcium carbonate amount na hardness under so here the answer is 10 ppm See next one. You see uh, one more problem. So that is a uh, so calculate the amount of lime. What is the formula of lime? CaO. So required to remove the hardness of 10 power 6 liter of water which contain 1.62 grams of calcium hydrogen carbonate in 1 liter so here information is given for 1 liter that we have to uh, do it for 10 to 6 liters so first of all 1 liter we find out Sheta. so which type of hardness will be arised which type of hardness is uh, present in this water so calcium hydrogen carbonate we know that calcium hydrogen carbonate cause, causes temporary hardness how to remove the temporary hardness with the help of uh, reacting with lime so that's why it is given the amount of lime so the amount to take a 10 power 6 water loan na hardness remove challenge day how much lime is required so we must know the reaction at first calcium hydrocarbonate reacting with CaO so it forms a so I have to try to balance the equation 3, 6, 6 7 ok 3, 4, 5, 6 
so actually the reaction is uh, not this one so see here there is no formation of carbon dioxide gas okay this was the original equation so okay two parallels now it is balanced okay here see this what is the comparison this is one mole this is one mole one mole calcium hydrogen carbonate required same one mole of lime so first write the statement in terms of mole so one mole of uh, calcium hydrogen carbonate requires required same one mole of lime but uh, the problem is given in terms of a uh, uh, what's that gram so convert it into gram so each now value state we can convert it into moles it's our choice one mole i am converting it to grams one mole means one molecular weight it's molecular weight 162 162 grams of calcium carbonate requires one mole one mole means again it's molecular weight 56 grams of uh, co then what is for 1.62 gram 1.62 gram need how much co so directly we can say that is a 0.56 so 0 0.56 grams of uh, lime is required so actually this 1.62 grams was uh, dissolved in 1 liter but we have to calculate it for 10 power 6 liters so we can uh, uh, require uh, to remove the hardness of 1 liter water ok therefore we can write uh, for 1 liter water need how much lime? 0 0.56 gram of lime then what about uh, 10 power 6 liters Okay, ten power six. Let's uh, spell it uh, five point six. Grams of lime is required. Okay, just with the help of uh, equation, we have to do this. here see the next problem so find the degree of hardness nothing but hardness in terms of ppm that is with respect to calcium carbonate so now hardness find out this matter in terms of calcium carbonate there is no other choice so the find the degree of hardness of a sample of water containing 12 milligrams of magnesium sulfate per kg of water simple okay first one uh, it's per kg okay whatever first uh, mgso should be equalized into the mass of calcium carbonate so calcium carbonate will convert to them the magnesium sulfate equalized with uh, calcium carbonate here what is the molecular weight of magnesium sulfate that is 120 okay so it is 120 this is 100 here how many milligrams are present 12 milligrams so 12 milligrams therefore 12 milligrams is nothing but equal to so by 10 so by 10 is equal to 10 grams so there is a 10 grams of 
CaCO3. It is given in a 1 kg of water. So, it is uh, mg. So, mg is mg. mg. So, actually, every problem in grams to convert is so it is a other type of problem so other type of method so we nu kuda mana malli grams lo convert chestam anukondi idi grams lo convert chesi idi gram lo convert chesi mal 10 power 6 grams lo ki cheste that will get the hardness so kapothe pro 10 milligrams deenli gram lo convert chesi malli deenli gram lo convert chesina we will get the same answer okay so ee problem ki manaki two types chestam so actually ga milligram per kg of water man direct ka pp manachu so milligram per kg ana gram per 10 power 6 grams ana that will give the equal value okay uh, ee problem man so gram lo convert chesi chuda 10 milligrams of caco3 present in 1 kg of water so 1 kg 10 mil Generally, one of grams to convert with them. Actually, the milligrams direct gram, milligram in one kg one time we can say it is a ppm directly. So, how it is we see 10 milligrams the grams to convert in so 10 into 10 power minus 3 milligram is present in 1 kilogram. 1 kilogram means again 10 power 3 grams of water. But for ppm, we have to find it for 10 power 6 grams. So, 10 power 3 gram of water and how much? So, 10 power minus 3 and 10 power minus 2 grams. Minus 2 gram CaCO3. Then, what about for 10 power 6 gram? Means million grams. Million grams is how much? Okay, 10 power 3. So, how much will get uh, 10 power? So, 10 gram means a million grams of water. Million grams of water contain 10 grams of CaCO3. So, the equal its hardness is 10 ppm. So this is the answer is 10 ppm. So actually so direct the milligram kg each of the one press are grams lo convert just one 10 power 6 gram look chairs from some level. So milligram kg each of the direct the one milligram per kg ni we can treat it as a ppm. If a total calculation just a we will get the same thing. Gram lo convert is the same 10 grams ki 10 ppm was said. So we just write a note it. So that is a milligram per kg is also treated as 1 p so that is what ppm. 1 milligram and 1 ppm. Okay. Okay, milligram per kg. So kg and it is same. Milligram per liter sample is also treated as ppm. And we will say 10 power 6, 10 power 6 lo convert to So, in the milligrams cages, we will treat the same amount of ppm. Milligrams per liter is the same amount of ppm. So, we will solve the same amount should be equalized into calcium carbonate. Okay. We'll see the next one. So, 100 grams of a water sample is found to contain 12 milligrams of MgSO4 means causes permanent hardness. So, calculate the hardness of water sample. So, we know that uh, so hardness number calculate so and first convert that uh, cause compound uh, in, in terms of calcium carbonate. So, compare the magnesium sulfate into in terms of calcium carbonate. What is how many units of magnesium sulfate? 120, this is 100. Okay, so here it is given only 12. 
Portugal means it will become 10. So, grams are the grams, milligrams are gram, milligrams, no doubt. Really. And the kind of problem, so grams low chest. So, we given it 12 milligrams. 12 milligrams, nothing but equal to 10 mg S44. We grams low convert chest, so grams low convert chest. It is given 12 milligrams. So, therefore, 12 milligrams uh, equal to so 10 milligrams of CaCO3. So, this 10 milligrams of CaCO3 is present in 100 grams of water. So, actually, just now we said, so actually, 10 per this gram lo convert chesi, each na problem already grams lo on the 10 per 6 gram lo chase chai, simple one. So, kapa the people note and the pen of formula as the milligram per kg. So, milligram per kg you chase kunja, it's under milligram per 1000 grams. At 1000 grams of water lo, how many milligrams of uh, calcium carbonate dissolved? As you find out, chase na ostali. But when any problem 10 power 6 on a chest and gravity, e problem 10 power 6 this one they But it is a hint, you can do the short method also. 10 power milligrams of calcium carbonate. So 10 power 6 is calculate. So 100 grams, 100 grams means kg of convert chain 100. Sorry, already grams don't get no problem. So 100 grams of water. Container, how much convert into grams? 10 into 10 to minus 3 grams of uh, calcium carbonate. So, think in the take a unit this point, it could be units this point, 100 grams. So, then what about 10 to 6 grams of water contain how much CSO3? So on the calculation, we get uh, 100 ppm, okay, 10 power 6, okay, so it becomes just 3, so let's make a 1, 2, so my 2 bands, then becomes just 10 into 10, that is 100 gram, so 100 grams of CaCO3 in a 10 power 6 grams water, 10 power 6 grams water alone is nothing but it is ppm so there is a answer is 100 ppm see one more different problem on hardness that is a hardness of water is given as 200 ppm hardness of water is given is 200 ppm for a sample so i have to find the molarity and normality of calcium carbonate in water so only we know ppm is in a concentration concentration expressing method so a concept the ppm concentration a so molarity and normality low conversion so first uh, this is the what is meaning of this uh, ppm just uh, just one key point is hardness of water is how much sorry it is given 200 hardness of water is uh, 200 ppm so what does it mean 200 ppm then day so it implies that uh, 200 gram of calcium carbonate is present I think but it dissolved in 10 power 6 gram water so this is what ppm meaning hardness ppm meaning okay? so this much of grams are present in uh, million parts if the grams to this point 200 grams this point so 10 power c million gram of water no? 200 grams of CS given through that's why it is given at 200 ppm so now now we got the weight of solute this is weight of a, a solution okay so water load dissolved in the but that will be taken as the solution therefore what is the molarity of formula the weight of solute by 
gram molecular weight of solute into thousand by volume in milliliters. A gram. What about ten power six grams of water? Nothing but it is equal to ten power six milliliter because it's a water density one gram per milliliter. But we can take it as ten power six milliliter. So substitute the values. So weight of solute how much? Two hundred grams. Gram molecular weight how much? Calcium carbonate is hundred. Okay. But how many milliliters? Ten power six milliliters. So just on calculation, so we will get. Uh, Yes, yeah, six. Uh, there is a three. Means uh, now it is having how much? Two into ten power minus three molarity. So molarity ka but we can say simple capsulium. Capsulium means small splitter. This is molarity. Now calculate the normality. We have a relation between the molarity and normality. So this is the first step. So this is the second step in this problem. So what is the molarity normality relation? Normality is equal to molarity into x factor. Because x factor means so bases get the acidity, acids get the basicity, salts get the charge. If it is a calcium carbonate, it is salt. So we must remember that calcium carbonate is salt. So calcium carbonate low. What is the charge? C A plus two. C O three minus two. So units charge units this quite a lot two. So normal equal four into ten power minus three n. Okay. Okay. Check the one more problem. Based on hardness, that uh, calculate the hardness of water sample which contain zero point zero zero one mole of MgS four four dissolved per liter of water. So if you remember, okay, first problem start here, that okay. So before normal game, just the manam, ah, it's na. What is the cause? This uh, MgS four four means uh, it shows the permanent hardness. So MgS four four, a salt, it's na manam, okay. Ah, we convert it into Uh, calcium carbonate. So grams, we say, but direct the hundred grams. So for example, then one twenty grams is equal to hundred grams of calcium carbonate. So moles, we say, but exactly same this goes. Grams, we say, but more molecular weights compared to that. Moles, we say, but exactly moles this goes. That means that the grams will convert this goes. Okay, simple. So actually, the moles is this become very simple compared to the grams. So we have to compare that. Uh, so zero point zero zero one. MgS four four moles, okay. So moles का बटे there is no change direct करासेज zero point zero zero one mole of uh, calcium carbonate. So direct. So what is the weight of calcium carbonate? So moles cells, moles cells. So how to find out the weight? We you know the number of moles equals weight by gram molecular weight. So number of moles in this one zero point zero zero one. So I have to find the weight, kada. Okay, weight. So we combine this number ten power six grams. Keep. Okay. Uh, weight. Therefore, weight of uh, CaCO three is equal to normal number of moles into gram molecular weight. Is equal zero point zero one gram. Zero point one gram. Then we have the per liter water. So per liter water. So we can say one liter. So one liter equal ten power three milliliter. Nothing but ten power three grams. Okay, water is our density one gram. Ten power three grams of uh, water contain. 0.1 gram CaCO3. So only we know 
और प्रॉब्लम एनी ग्राम से चार ही टेन पावर सिक्स हाँ मच सो ऑन डी कैलकुलेशन तो विल गेट हंड्रेड पीपी ओके So remaining three ten power three one by ten square ten square that is a hundred people. So these are the so these are the different problems based on hardness of water. Actually, so all these problems are taken from different type of books. Okay, uh, so uh, try to keep the notes uh, neatly. Okay.